Hey, David here with Guide Recommended, and we're gonna be talking through my little sunglass problem I've got, but specifically for today, we're gonna talk about the Costa sunglasses versus the Maui Gyms, specifically the Costa Del Mar Fantails. The Fantails are the blackout frame with the copper green polarization and the 580G glass lens. For the local kinds, they will be the bronze HCL polarization with the matte black frame and the cream two-tone. So inside of these has a two-tone look to it, really stylish. Go through five factors I think are best for fishing sunglasses. I'll tally them up in the end. These two are so close. This will be a fantastic evaluation to see which one is gonna fit your style and work best on the water. So what's the five factors? We're gonna talk about on water performance performance with the polarization. We'll talk about UV protection. I tested each of these. I've got a UV lens and a card shining the light through. High-end glasses like these are gonna work real well. Comfort and fit. This might be the deciding factor between these two. Durability, we're gonna to touch on things that make sunglasses durable, right? Springs in the hinges, glass lens, and then what I call the fishy factor, which is a combination of so many different things. A wide side panel, a spring in the hinge, a glass lens, comfort both in the nose pad and the ear pad. Now in the end, I'm gonna to touch on some other things like style and what's included in the box. So let's jump into the comparison, stacking these two up next to each other with our fishy background. Ah, if you can, subscribe. I need more folks to subscribe to my channel. I'm really investing some time, some effort, some money into providing evaluations like this with so many pairs of sunglasses. And really subscribing is gonna let you see what I've got coming up, which is a budget evaluation of sunglasses as well. So on water, the Costas, I give a nine, and the Maui Gyms a nine as well. Both of these sunglasses excel at looking at fish in the water. I've tried to position the sun in this picture in order to get the most glare and see how well the polarization works. UV resistance, just like you'd expect, eight and eight. These sunglasses are the top of the top. For comfort and fit, I give the Costas a seven and the Maui Gyms an eight. Why is that? The Maui Gyms actually have a spring in the hinge it's going to lend a little bit more comfort to those as well. Durability, I give the Costas an 8 and the Maui Gym a 9. Why did the Costas get that 8? Well, again, back to that spring in the hinge. Having a spring in the hinge is going to make your sunglasses a little bit more durable, right? Think about flexing them as you put them on and off. Fishy factor, 8 and 8. Both of these sunglasses exhibit the characteristics that are going to be fantastic for underwater. A big side shield, a nice hook over the Ear. comfortable ear pads and nose pads those things are gonna just work out better for comfort for an angler all right let's touch on the price the Costa Fantails are currently running at $273 as I look at them and the Maui Jim local kind are coming in at 279 so right in that same price range couple bucks difference between the two and as you're looking at these pictures notice the color in the tint is just a little bit different now the Maui Jims have what's called a bronze and the Costa Fantails have what's called a copper now when it comes to style, I had my daughter try on both of these. Let's get her on with both sunglasses. You can see that they're both a little bit on the big side for a petite little girl. My daughter's maybe five foot three. She would not like me to say how tall she is. And then here's me wearing both those sunglasses. Now I do think that that mirrored glass, that green mirror on the Costas does look pretty dang cool. Now jump over to the Maui Gyms. They have that two-tone frame standout feature as well. Really cool to hold those glasses in your hand and look at them. All right, what's included with each of these? A nice zippered case with the Costa Del Mars. Now, when it jumps over to the Maui Gyms, you get this like flexible box that's got a magnetic closure. It's not gonna protect your glasses. So there you have it, my score between the two. Again, I'm gonna call it a toss up. You really gotta evaluate this for you, the fisherman, right? Give me some comments below on things that you'd like to see as well on this and 
please, it's free. Sign up for my Fishing Friday newsletter, link below, along with these sunglasses where you can get them on Amazon. My Fishy Friday newsletter is a really fun little newsletter where I share things happening with me on the water. We share conservation projects. Now we got a little brag board where you can send in a picture of the fish that you'd like to share with over 10,000 other readers of the newsletter. Tight lines, thank you.